Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Kelvin here. So recently, there's been a lot of crypto games popping up, like crypto games, crypto games everywhere. And among them, you have Neko Inu. The reason this game caught my attention was because I've been seeing it everywhere, even in my email. And best of all, this game can give a godlike 5% return a day. Yes, you heard it right, not 5% a year, it is 5% every single day. So in this video, I want to review this game and tell you why I feel this game is scammy. But before I start, I would greatly appreciate it if you can help to tap the like button because it will help out with the channel a lot. And someone in the comment section asked me to say this. So I will show you a cute astrolotto. All right, let's start right now. First up, let's talk about how this game works. According to the website, this game is a virtual world beyond your imagination, adding fun to your life. Nice. So here's how this game works. After signing up, you have to buy one pet. Each pet costs differently. You have the cheapest pet at 50 USDT all the way to the most expensive pet at 2400 USDT. Then every 12 hours, you can do 5 actions like this. Very wow, much fun, such imagination. And for every action that you do, your pet value increases by 1% up to 5% every 12 hours. There's a 12 hour timer. And when the timer reaches zero, you can sell your pet to earn money. Then you can repeat your process all over again. You can also play some fun mini games and join some jackpot to earn extra prizes. Here's the most interesting thing. Whenever you refer a friend, you can earn 10% commission whenever your friend buys a pet. For example, if your friend buys this at $500, you will earn $50. But wait, that's not all. When your friend sells his pet, he will earn some money, right? He will also earn up to 5% on his profit. Or to put it simply, when you play this game and refer your friends, you won't just quite big big. You will quite see big, see big, big. Ah. If you add up everything, it will easily give you 1,000 to 2,000% profit in a year. Nice. So that was a quick intro to a world beyond your imagination gameplay. If you try to search who's behind this game, it will say this game is a global joint venture between a Hong Kong consortium and casino in Cambodia with the support of Lemon Game. And they even show you the team members, like Chris Wallace here is an expert in a lot of stuff, similar to the CTO. This reminds me of a time when I was interviewing people. What I found was that sometimes when people write down their qualifications, it doesn't mean that they know their stuff. Probably they watch a quick tutorial on YouTube and claim that they are an expert and has a master degree in everything. When I tried to search for them in LinkedIn, none of them exist. Interesting. So you might be wondering, how is Neko Inu able to pay you 5% every day? That's because of two things. First, fees, fees everywhere. When you try to make a transaction, they will charge you a godlike 2% fee. When you try to withdraw your money, there's a 5% fee. On top of that, after your first deposit, if you try to withdraw anytime within 30 days, you will only get 30% back. The percentage increases every 30 days and you can finally withdraw everything after 90 days. So this means that once you start playing, you are locked in the game for 3 months. And even though they have some user testimonial that says withdrawal is quick and efficient, that's not the case. You have to wait 48 hours to withdraw your money. Second, the money comes from your referral. Every time you invite a new player, he will have to buy a new pet, right? Neko Inu will take the money and pay you and they will take your referrals referral to pay your referral. If you draw a graph up, you will get something that looks like a Ponzi scheme. Is Neko Inu a Ponzi scheme? I don't know. So here's the thing about the game. It doesn't tell you all these fees out front. The only thing it tells you is the fun, imaginative game and how you can earn money by playing it. But more importantly, it tells you to invite your friends to play the game so that you can quite big big by inviting more people. And because of this, I've been seeing this game everywhere I go. In my inbox, there's already 3 people trying to recruit me. When you check Market Watch, you will see a press release from Neko Inu. When you check Reddit, you will see people reviewing the game and end with a sneaky sneaky referral code. Here's another one, and he even has a roadmap. Let's see, by Q2 2022, there's a PvP and adventure mode. Good luck with that. And of course, not forgetting the referral code. And in Hardware Zone, people are promoting it too. And of course, there's a disclaimer saying that you should only put in what you can afford to lose. Because you know, to protect is best side. There's even a few advertisements in Carousel. Obviously, there's a lot of publicity on Neko Inu. So much so, the Telegram group had almost 7,000 members in it. So here's why I think Neko Inu is possibly a scam. Let's first talk about the obvious points first. First, super high returns. Yes, yes, I know that Tesla gave WTF returns in 2020. God, lie. 
But that was only because Tesla was flat for many, many years before people finally realized that Tesla has potential. Tesla definitely can't promise to give you a very high return year after year. Or can it? Meanwhile, at Neku Inu, you can easily earn 5% a day. And if you refer your friends, you will earn even more. In a year, you can easily earn 1,000 to 2,000 plus percent returns. Wow, if so good, why don't the CEO Mr. Chris Wallace go and sell house, sell kidney and all in to his own imaginative game? Here's an easy rule to follow. Anytime someone tells you that he can guarantee a high return, ah, it's 99% a scam. Second, this game encourages you to promote the game and invite more players. Yes, yes, I know this is happening to Tesla also. You will see many YouTubers and blogs and Wall Street bets promoting Tesla. It's same same but different. The reason most people are promoting Tesla is because they think that Tesla is a good investment. On the other hand, people are promoting Neko Inu is because they stand to benefit financially. I tried asking the people who's trying to invite me how it can generate such high returns. He wasn't able to answer me. And when I asked if he thinks it's a Ponzi scheme or not, he avoided the question completely. Dodge 100%. I told the other guy I'm skeptical. Even he agrees that he himself is skeptical. Third, as the saying goes, not your keys, not your coins. Even though it says, using the latest technology, we provide full decentralization. This game asks you to deposit USDT to their wallet. So it's an obvious lie. This means that if any time Neko Inu decides to close shop, you will lose everything, he will lose everything, everyone will lose everything. Except for Chris Wallace and his team right there. They will quite big big. On the other hand, real crypto games actually let you keep your assets in your own wallet. For example, Asset Infinity, anything that you have will be kept in your own wallet. Your SRP, your RAP ETH, and even your own characters. Yes, sure, if the game fails, a lot of stuff will lose their value. But the point is, you have full custody of your own stuff. No one else has access to it. Fourth, potential rug pull. I'm sure you have seen rug pull happening almost every other week, with the latest rug pull being the Squid Game rug pull. Before the rug pull, users were already aware that they were unable to withdraw the token, but they still went ahead and invest in it anyway. This is similar to Neko Inu. Sure, they can say you can withdraw anytime, but you have to wait 48 hours during which they can easily rug pull you. By the way, there's two very big signs that a rug pull might happen. First one is credit to SEC Crypto for pointing this out. If you check the website info, it says that the website was registered in November 2020 and will expire on November 2022. Meanwhile, you will see other reputable sites have a longer expiry date. Like Google only expires in 2028. Facebook website only expires on 2031. Will Neko Inu renew the cert or will they just take your money and run before November 2022? Let's see. Another sign is their roadmap. If you check it out, it's only up to Q2 2022. What happens after that? We have a few more months before we find out, yeah? Fifth, the team doesn't exist. Yes, yes, I know they show their team members, but you can't find any info about them. For all I know, they might even be from Wakanda. On the other hand, for top crypto games, you know who's the team behind the game. Like this guy is SE Infinity's CEO, and this guy is behind Crypto Kitty. Ask yourself this, if you're walking on the street and some Apex comes and tell you, a boy, yeah, you give me $500, let's say I give you $5,000. I think you will quickly run away instead of giving him the money. Ah. Last but not least, as a gamer and a game programmer myself, here's my review. This game sucks. Ah. Art style is super super bad. It's just a point and click game that's totally zero fun in it. Even my intern has made better game than this. Ah. Overall, here's my score. Fun, 0 out of 10. Scamminess, 10 out of 10. Totally would not recommend. Is it a scam or not? Personally, I'm not 100% sure, but there are just way too many red flags. If you want better and safer ways to earn money, I've done a lot of videos on that already. Ah. So anyway, that was my review on Neko Inu. What do you think? Is it a scam or not? Let me know down in the comments below. Like, share, and subscribe as I'll be posting new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday.